What's going on everybody? This is Riyad here with a new fighting game tutorial. In this video, we're going to make, um, well, I think in this video I will um, send the, uh, the data to the client so the client can draw the player. So if we did something like, um, I don't know, let's uh, do not draw the player, okay? So in the draw event, we're not uh, making something like draw self. So this object uh, will not be in the room. Actually, it is in the room, but we are not rendering it. Let me just move the recorder a little bit, okay? So if we run the game now, multiplayer, host, yup. I press G, yup. So actually, the player is here but we cannot see it and one more thing guys so remember the network and script um, in the receive data um, make sure this is dsmap replace instead of dsmap add okay so this is very important because we already have um, this socket as a key so we, um, when we get a new uh, value for this uh, for this key then we need to replace it okay so yeah now let's start coding so the client can draw um, the player well, first of all we need to send some variables to the player okay so let's say with obj remote remote player okay um, so we cannot do something like buffer right uh, player buffer because the cl this object cannot access this variable so let's make another variable global dot player buffer equals player buffer okay so now we're going to use global dot player buffer instead of player buffer because the player can access uh, this one okay so buffer um wait buffer and sign at 32 integer i think that's good okay so we send that ex position okay um Okay, we're going to send the y, the, the sprite index, sprite index, and the image index, and finally, um, make sure this is signed in 8 integer, 8 bit integer, integer, wow, image x scale. So, now we are sending the x y sprite index and image index and finally the image scale keep in mind that um, signed uh, integer can handle uh, negative numbers okay so uh, the image scale can be whether negative one or one that's why I have here select uh, signed eight bit integer as uh, a type okay so as you can see here we are all already sending all this data to the client now the only thing we need to do is go to our um, client here in the network and let's do something like um, okay so now we're receiving this data uh, and we have a sprites list um, the sprite list so we're, we're going to store all the data in this sprite list so uh, first we need to clear the list because we need to refresh the data servers of I mean, sprites list okay now let's say for i or for variable i equals zero i is less than um, sprites basically i plus plus Okay, um, this list at socket, uh, I mean sprites list, wait, 
writes list and buffer read um, buffer buffer u32 okay so let me just keep that open here and open the server here so we can see the data okay let's copy that four times or five times actually six because we need to send another variable which is the player name so this should be buffer string and um, what was the I think it was the name let me just check the variable yep it's a name okay so let's open the server again okay so the first one is ensign at 32 the next one is the same this is uh, sign at 60 u8 oops u8 sign at 8 finally straight okay so now we are receiving data and now we need to display it on the screen so let's go to our draw event and let's add some variable here for index equals 0 okay now for i or variable i equals 0 make sure to use variables in both for loops because we already have um, an i variable so yeah i is less than players i plus plus oops i plus plus now um, let's make some other variables xx yy sprite index scale and the name okay so xx equals um, this list find value here um, id uh, it's uh, sprites list and the position in index plus plus so let's do that like um, six more times oops okay so this is yy sp n sc and name so now draw sprite um sp index xx yy um scale one rotation zero and color uh, it's better to keep it white and the alpha one okay oh oops oh and this needs to be sprite um ext okay and let's draw text in xx yy minus um it's about um, 75 and the name is name okay mm, first of all let's um, draw set line fast center okay and then Okay, so if we test the game now, we should see um, player on the screen. Remember that we are not drawing the player using this draw event, but actually we draw it using this one. Okay, so come on. Oops, where is the problem? Uh, really? In OBG client draw event where, where is the problem? At line twenty two really? Yeah, I'm 
is that one. So let's re mm -hmm. let's run the game. First, let's change the character. So, oh, okay. Let's, let's change the name. Host. Yup, yup, yup. Oops. Players. Oh. Yup. So this should be sprite instead because. Okay. Let's make sure that. Yup, this is also sprite. So. Let's run the game now and hopefully we will not get any error. Okay, multiplayer. Let me change the character and the name. Let's host. Yup, let me join. And... Whoa. Really? Did I? List Okay. Come on, let's run the game and Okay. FSG and Yep. So as you can see here, guys. Now I can see the. Pla Whoa! Wait. I think I have changed my um character, didn't I? Hmm. Sprite and this or. Oh wait, I think S6 is not, um, no it should work fine, but just to make sure, let's, um, I don't know where's the problem, but let's make it unsigned, and the client, let's, oh my god, I hate to have that. Okay. Okay, multiplayer. Let's make sure to change your character. Let's go and create a game. SG. I don't know. We still have the same sprite. Why? Hmm. Wait a little bit. Is this because I, yeah I deleted somehow I deleted the this code yeah that's why stand sprite okay so now everything is working fine I guess. Let me change the character. Create host. Press G and yup. And for the remote player, let's uh, set the image speed 
which is something like 0 0.2 oh, okay so you can find all the codes for this example in the description and yeah so i'll see you in the next video guys don't forget to like and subscribe and in the next tutorial we're going to um, move the player make it move and maybe shoot it the planets and stuff like that so don't forget to like subscribe and i'll see you in the next video bye bye